the wrong one. G'day everyone, welcome to the bite-sized break. 264 for the uh, select footy stars. Couple of trades. Jazzapai's got the Bulldogs. Destroyer. Port Adelaide. Penrose. GWS. Maddie West Coast. And Liquid Green. Welcome aboard. Lovely to see some new people again. Always good. Let's see how we end up tonight. Good luck this afternoon, I should say. Bang! It's a little bite-sized break. We'll go one value pack a box, a value pack a box. They've been good to us, the little three boxes, though. Uh, two boxes, I should say. Phenomenal. Callum Mills to kick us off here. Langdon, Strike Force, and Harry Morrison in the red. Strike Force, Jay Gresham, Sean Lemons. See it all. Okay. Oh, that was dumb. 100 games, David Swallow. Not another footy. Oh, we're handing them out like Slurpees on a hot day. All right. Box one in the two boxer. G'day, Joe. The two boxes have been phenomenal. That's all you can say, really. Platinums have been in many of them. 18 bucks. Chance at a plat. Can't go wrong. Oh, Jesus. <coughs> Instant impact. Devin Smith. I might have a choke. <coughs> On camera. Did you missed it by one break, Dr. Muff. Sean Lemons. We hit dust in the last break. You missed it by one. Mark Hutchings. Strike Force, Jack Darling. But a Platinum Dusty. Well, we didn't need a Platinum, we need a Gold Dusty. Braden Fiorini. Yeah, we'll whack him there. We're going to have to move those packs, though. Definitely going to have to move those packs. Looks like it's getting a little bit darker outside. Stevenson. You've seen it, oh no. Instant Impact, Steph Martin. Well, you never know your luck. Who you got today? Richmond and... Oh, you got Richmond and Collingwood. Grundy. What about a Grundy? Paddy Ryder. Would you take a Grundy? Lockie Hunter. Or a Pendles. James Stewart. It's a little bite-sized break. 100 games, Jeremy McGovern. Michael Walters. Charlie Cameron, Strike Force. Jazz has got two cards. Oh, here comes the first brown loaf. She's gold. It's a clean skin. No tattoos. It's Michael Hurley for the Bombers. 22. Maddie. Well done, Maddie. Picks up Mick Hurley. Nice way to start. Strike Force, Jack Martin. Uh, Jack Rewalt, Jack Martin. James Harms. Could he be best on? Maddie. Could he be BOG? Instant Impact, Callum Ward. 
Never know, it's a good one. Tie die Alice Yolman 239 Adelaide Crows. The Crows is crazy tides. He seems to hit a lot too. He's slowly but surely going up the ladder too. He's I think he's equal second on the uh, BOG table, the Brownlow. Lockie Whitfield. Callum Mills in the red will definitely clean up those silvers. They're annoying me already. That's half a box done with the two box hits out. Okay. Jaeger O'Meara. Trevaco, 200 games. So we get through. No, come on. Sorry, give me one sec. Hello? I'm, uh, I'm actually live on the break. What is it quickly? I'll send it to you as soon as I've finished here. Okay. That is work. Instant impact. Let's get through here. You need your second. Instant Impact, Isaac Smith. Rory Laird, Matt Tabernard. Michael Walters, Strike Force. This is still box one. It's like the, the box that never ends. 150, Daniel Talia. Rioli, yes, that was Josh Shackey. Jager got you the uh, the BOG, your first one. Double Jager. A double Jager shot. Would have had Christos in uh, hospital, I think. If he had have had one of those. Toby McLean. Papley. Ed Langdon there. As we move on through the first, this is just the first box. 100 games to Liam Jones, Tommy Barras. Strike Force Stringer. Jazza, he's got the, the pen and paper out. Joel Selwood, he's marking them off as he goes. Cruiser Impact. Who have you got, Jazza? Oh, you got the doggies. You traded for the dogs, didn't you? Zach Tui, James Aish. Strike Force, Eddie Betts. Eastern Wood. There you go. Five cards. Jaron Geary. College Jazdy there. Couldn't get pies. Don't care who else. You're like uh, Ryan Havercroft. He traded for Gold Coast twice. Couldn't get his team. Said he couldn't give a stuff. So he traded for Gold Coast. Unfortunately, he didn't win the footy. All right, here we go. Riley Bonner, Port Adelaide. Ripper! The break just got real sexy there. Once there's a Cripper in the house. Alex Rance. Two fifty a Grundy. The value packs are lean, lean at this stage. Let's get into our last. Nah, let's do the value pack. Let's do the value pack. 
This is the last one for here. We'll do the box last. Let's see if our luck changes here. Zach Fisher, Schnoz, part two, that one. For the Blues, Coops. No. Red McCarthy. Elliot, 100 games. They're either Feast or Famine. Famine, uh, Destroyer. Feast or Famine. James Harms. So we didn't get nothing extra today out of the value packs. But let's see what the last box. Go to Disney. Well, there you go. You've got nine chances to go to Disneyland. What more do you want than that? Nine chances to go. They're only put it at the same ratio as the boxes. So if you're thinking there's, you're going to beat some odds, you'll get lucky occasionally. But overall, it's exactly the same. One brown low every 36 packets on average. They're not at a better ratio. <laughs> Still waiting for the feast. Oh, well. Now you're getting me hungry. <laughs> no, the Brownlow's come out in the first packet. I'm not going to show it. Ed Kernow. Robbie Tarrant. I can tell you something tomorrow, kids. The Magnificent Seven is on. Look out. Cochin. That might cancel. Uh, that could cancel. I'll have to see what I did to Matt last year. The Magnificent Seven. Dom's listening. See what we did, Matt. Josh Dunkley. But the Magnificent Seven is on. I think. Jeremy Finlayson. Well, I'll see. Rainer. It's a long break, the Magnificent Seven. Jared Harbrow, Instant Impact. The Magnificent Seven is seven boxes, guaranteed two value pack. Uh, two value packs. Now you got me dreaming. Now, hang on. Jack Redden for West Coast. Maddie. Well, I'd say he's going to be hard to beat. Seven boxes, guaranteed two platinum brown lows. Brayshaw. Do I do it? If I do, I think I'll only do the one break tomorrow. That's a long sort. Instant impact there for the Swans. We've got a lot of boxes to get through. Do I go the Magnificent Seven? 150, Nick Natanui. It's just a long pack. Jazza reckons don't do it. Timmy English. What if, what if we get Dan to do the Magnificent 19 boxes? Jack Viney. Harry Mackay. Dan or Brownie. Brownie and Dom, the Magnificent 19. Imagine that. Four Platinums. James Sicily. That'd be a big one. Sean Higgins, 200 games. Oh, that's his boot. Dom and Brownie, the Magnificent 19. That'd be phenomenal. David Armitage. Jared Berry. I'd have to work out that because everything goes up. Levi Casbolt. Fees go up, taxes go up. People forget that. We're a legitimate business here at Select. Our prices are all including GST and all taxes. Rory Thompson. Gimco fees, PayPal fees as well. The dearer the break, the dearer it goes up. Unfortunately, that's the way of the world. Dyson Heppel. 
Can I repeat that? I can if you like. 100 games, Josh Green. Josh Bruce. Tim Kelly. Lipinski. I would have to work it out, Jazza, because the fees go up. Instant impact. Tommy Jonas. We pay a PayPal fee every spot that's bought. No, no, funnily, I wish there was. Instant, I'd be retired. Unfortunately, we have to pay all the taxes and the GST. Tommy Mitchell, 100 games. So when you see some other people that pay no tax, uh, no PayPal fee, Jay Gresham, and they're doing the breaks for $5 dearer than we are paying everything, you have to scratch your head, don't you? You really have to scratch your head. Oh well. Maybe they are doing something with the Canary Islands. Blake Akers. Lucky Fogarty. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm paying the Carlton tax this year. Everyone bags us, but gee whiz. Zach Langdon, try and buy some Carlton cards. I'm getting quoted prices that give you a heart attack. Maxi Gorn. Hey mate, I've got a uh, K. I don't know who. Let me, I've got a Zach Fisher Brownlow. How much you want for it? Ah, two hundred. Yeah, okay, mate. He's a big chance to win it. Ben McAvoy. Mitch Duncan. Dave Mirror. Josh Shacky. We're down to five packets in this one. Three sleeps. It is indeed. It is three sleeps away. Instant impact, Robbie Tarrant. I work weekends, so it's very hard for me to get to the footy. So I ended up... I did... <laughs> I did buy a 84-inch... Uh, TV, so at least I can watch it in style for the games I can't go to. Charlie Dixon can only really get, can't take any more time off work. Actually, that, that's what that phone call was about to try and get an extra week off work. Instant impact, Jack Billings. So I'll end up getting the lemon and sass, I reckon. They don't mind a couple of weeks off for um, the footy cards. Ben Ronk. I think Select just need to A. Hey, Come on, mate. Fork up. Pay up. They're getting me for peanuts. Peanuts. All right. Let's see what this last Brownlow is. She's gold. Oh, don't tell me. I think this is unbelievable. It's unbelievable. It's a bloody Gold Coast Sun again. Surely not another footy. Benny Dub. Benny W's got it. Here we go. This could be another footy. This could be another footy. Probably the last one they'll give me after this one. Ben W on the verge of a football. I'm scared to pull it back. I don't want to see it. I'm terrified. It could be the last ever footy. It's Sharon Arbrow. 155. Benny W. Well, I get terrified now. Two footies in two weeks. We only gave two the whole of last year. I have to make the phone call. Look, we got another footy. You do realise they're one hundred and sixty-nine dollars each. Well, that's the that's the way the cookie crumbles. That is it. Best on ground is the Bombers. It's Michael Hurley, which is Maddie Kutzer. Maddie, 
V O G. He got the double act. He got the West Coast one as well. That is it. That is it, kids. Let's have a great rest of your Monday night. That's it for me. I will uh, make a decision about the Magnificent Seven or not. I'll weigh it up. I'll have a look what we did last year with it. Um, I'll talk with Dom, see what we can do. If we do that, there won't be the little uh, nine spot. Uh, nine spot. Could Dom and Brownie... Would people be interested in a 19 boxer? That's the question. <laughs> Dom and Brownie going head bang and bang and bang and bang. 19 boxes? Possibly? I don't know. We'll work it out. We'll work it out. It could be the Magnificent Seven. I mean, that'd be huge. 19 boxes would be amazing, but... As I told you all, the price would have to be up. Postage will go up. The fees will go up. We'll work it out. I'll work it out. We'll crunch the numbers. We'll work it out. And we'll see where we go. It would be a fantastic uh, break, wouldn't it? it? would be phenomenal. Um, I'll weigh that up. Anyway, big thank you to everyone who went in today. Uh, I'll get all these out to you guys uh, tomorrow. It's funny, I went to the post office today with a with three boxes and I get them to stamp everything so there's a date on it. And I swear to God, I don't know if he was taking the P155 out of me or not, but he wears glasses. He's an XAFO umpire. And have I got a pair of sunnies here? No, I don't. Yep, no, I don't. He did the old... Uh, do the glasses like that and I thought, is he sticking his finger up at me or what and he did it like three times i thought eh, eh. i don't think he's too happy that i brought in about 150 envelopes to be individually stamped so anyway that's another story i'll be back there tomorrow they should be happy i'm buying about 900 bucks in stamps a week from them so they should be stamping with the courtesy they did give me a christmas present anyway that is it hope you enjoyed the break